Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Aditi. So in today's video, I'm actually going to try out a whole new different base routine. Uh, the technique is completely different that I usually do for my base makeup. Just watching random, you know, makeup tutorials, new makeup techniques, because that is my favorite thing to do in my free time. And that's when I just saw this video on Christine channel. So this is the 2023 new makeup technique where uh, you just want to do your makeup completely in a reverse order so I just watched this video and that really looked so so beautiful so I thought let's just try this one out because the techniques that she has used in this tutorial is just completely opposite and I just want to see how this works out for my skin and you know like for Indian skin if this really works for brown skin girls as well so let's try that out my skin is like really nicely moisturized you can clearly see I have done my skincare already about half an hour ago and my skin feels really nice and hydrated and really really moisturized which is perfect for you know makeup and now let's begin the first thing that she did is her brows like literally who am I like I never do my brows first like this my brows is like my second last or third last step in my makeup routine but it's like completely different i'm just gonna do my brows exactly the way she did and yeah just avoid my hair my hair is a mess you know that is the problem with curly hair your whatever you do but your hair just kind of stays a little frizzy so i just refuse to style my hair now because i'm like no i'm not gonna damage my hair so i just tied my hair in a ponytail because i just don't like my hair all over my face when i'm doing my makeup so yeah i just tied my hair in a ponytail and now let's begin with our brows I don't know how is this gonna turn out to be very honest because usually when I do my brows there's some product some powder in my brows and that's uh, how your brow product kind of you know uh, gets stuck to uh, your brows so right now my eyebrows are like quite greasy because of all the skincare to be very honest but let's see how is this gonna work but I feel it's always great to try different techniques and you never know which can work for you right uh, so I'm always up for you know different makeup techniques because there's literally no rule when it comes to makeup whatever works for you is your technique right so yeah that's why I was like you know what let's just try this out because in this technique if this works out for me uh, you are actually end up gonna use very less product which is uh, always my priority I don't like to you know layer so much product on my face because to be very honest when you layer so much product it might look you know great and flawless on camera but in person it just does not look that good unless you are uh, you know having the great skin days uh, when you know whatever amount of makeup you put it just looks amazing and flawless but if you're just putting so much of makeup on top of your acne just covering up it up and you know just trying to make it look as flawless as possible but trust me it doesn't because in person it's gonna look too much and too cakey so just try so I always try to put as less product as possible and I always try to just focus on uh, you know more like on my skincare the bad part is that I'm due for my brows so my brow hair is actually everywhere so abhi kafi thick lagne wali meri brows as you can clearly see right but it's okay i'm shooting this video early today like i usually don't shoot my videos this early it's like 10 30 or 11 ish am i usually don't shoot this early but i was free today i was not working out or anything so i was like you know what let's just try this makeup technique out with you guys i'm just using a brow mascara to kind of make sure that my brow hair stay at place before doing anything i'm just gonna prime my face because that's obviously very very important and i cannot do it in the end right so ye wala jo part hai ye hum reverse nahi kar sakte so i'm just gonna prime my face and i'm using a silicone based primer so jo bhi you know pores hai wo acche se cover up ho jaye and abhi thoda thoda na like garmi bhi start ho gayi hai so I kind of get a little bit oily on my T-zone so silicone based primers or mattifying primers kind of help me to just avoid that. Shooting early feels really great to be very honest because you know I love my work and I just love shooting so whenever I shoot early it's like yeah I'm starting my day uh, on a good note but usually on most of the days I work out at this point so yeah that's why I had to shoot all my videos about 
वन और टू पी एम बट सुबह सुबह शूट करने का एक ड्रॉबैक ये है कि यू नो ऑल द कबाड़ी वाला सब्जी वाला ऑल द वेंडर्स एवरी वन इज हेयर लाइक वो चक्कर लगाएंगे एंड वो आवाज़ लगाएंगे एंड इट्स लाइक अनॉइंग बट ऑब्वियसली इट्स देर वर्क एंड दे हैव टू डू इट बट इसीलिए मैं अवॉइड करती हूँ सुबह सुबह शूट करना क्योंकि इट्स द टाइम राइट बट यू माइट योर सामवन लाइक सेंग सब्जी ले लो एन something like that so please avoid that but yeah my skin feels so really nice and soft these days i'm like taking care of my skin and taking care of my hair and it feels great when you just you know uh, put that extra effort for yourself you know and i'm just doing that for myself these days i'm just you know understanding what is working for me and i feel when you just really you know take that time out for yourself and just understand what is what exactly is working for you and when you just consistently do that you would see results it might take a while but you would definitely see results and that's what i've been doing i com i was completely off my active ingredients these days because i was like my skin is getting really irritated so i literally just shut down the skin care drawer and i was like you know what i'm just going to use my moisturizer and my sunscreen and that's it that's literally it and uh you know sometimes less is more and it really worked out for me so it's like i was just taking some rest for my skin and my skin is like now healing uh, it feels really nice and soft so i love it okay so next thing that she did was contouring her face i never did it like i'm really really excited to see how this is going to work so i'm just going to take a cream contour and i'm just going to take it on the back of my hand because i just don't want want to risk it ki main directly face pe laga du aur wo blend hi nahi ho raha hai so i just took it on the back of my hand and then i'm going to take a brush and just draw the lines wherever i want it to be just taking a brush and i'm just going to take the contour and apply that on my face it's not showing up that much so i have to apply a little bit directly because ब्रश से आई थिंक ये उतना ज़्यादा ट्रांसफर नहीं हो पा रहा है तो हम जस्ट गन अप्लाई इट लाइक दिस फॉर नोज ऑफकोर्स हम गन यूज अ ब्रश बिकॉज इट्स लाइक रियली बिग तो सब खराब हो जाएगा सो या आई एम जस्ट गन यूज अ ब्रश फॉर दैट आई थिंक आई एम ब्लाबरिंग अ लॉट इन दिस वीडियो यूजली आई जस्ट डू लाइक अ सेट डाउन गेट रेडी विथ मी और यू नो I usually prefer to do a voice over because I'm like no one is here to listen to my shit like come on but then I was like uh I personally love to watch content which is like when the creator is talking to me it feels like a communication right and that's why I love Malvika Satlani because she always does that right she's just like communicating with us so i love watching her content and i'm like you know what let's just do that because i love doing that i feel like it kind of uh, create that bond a connection with the creator and the you know audience so let's try this also and if you like it let me know i'll try to do it more often am i looking like a joker i think i am but it's okay i'm just going to apply a little bit of this on my jawline as well to get like a more chiseled jawline i've been working out these days like really really consistently and i do not have a double chin if you can see i do not have a double chin it feels so good you know because it's again like self care i have been working out very very consistently properly and eating good and it feels really really good so Yeah, I do not have the double chin, but I still feel like if you just apply a little bit of contour, there's a little bit like little bit of you know shadow created by it, so it looks really nice and chiseled. Because when you apply your foundation, it kind of makes everything very even toned. So yeah, adding this would give a little bit of warmth there. Next up, what she did was she applied a cream highlighter. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna apply the highlighter here. on the highest points of my face the only concern that i have at this point ye sab blend ho jayega na because i never do this i cuz i never never do my makeup like this ever 
मैं प्रोडक्ट लगाती हूँ फिर ब्लेंड करती हूँ फिर प्रोडक्ट लगाती हूँ फिर ब्लेंड करती हूँ सो आई नेवर लीव माई प्रोडक्ट्स दिस लॉन्ग ऑन माई स्किन बट लेट्स जस्ट ट्रस्ट द प्रोसेस यू नो सो दैट्स वेयर शी डिड इट राइट हीयर ऑल्सो I'm just gonna apply a little bit of highlighter. Next up, I'm gonna use a blush, and I'm gonna use a cream blush. So of course, we are gonna go on top of products because that's obvious, right? ये products एक दूसरे के ऊपर तो जाने ही वाले हैं. So I'm just gonna apply my blush like this. I think now we are pretty much done with the application of the product. Now we're just going to blend everything. So I'm just taking a brush, like a stiff brush, and मैं सबसे पहले अपना contour blend करने वाली हूँ. So let's see कि कितना अच्छे से blend हो पाता है. I'm just gonna push the product in the upward direction do not go down because bahut hi droopy lagne lagega face so do not do that mujhe lag raha hai kafi zyada product ho gaya hai but anyways we're going to apply some foundation so i think wo sab ho jayega manage i'm just you know trying to be positive about it so yeah like as i was doing i've been working out really consistently these days and of course i'm seeing results i have you know lost a few kgs and that's what i wanted to do i gained a few and i was feeling a little off it's not like mai bahut moti ho gayi or something and that's completely also fine but i just wanted to be in shape and that's why i was like i always work out it's been years that i work out now i think it's been more than 4 to 5 years that i'm like really quite consistent but sometimes i just overeat i don't really think about my diet and sometimes i just you know be a little lazy when it comes to work out as well so of course thoda bahut weight gain ho gaya tha and i also had an accident last year so i was on bed rest so tabhi bhi mera weight gain ho gaya to I was like, no, I really gotta lose this weight, and that's why I started working out really, really consistently. And you know, whenever you do stuff consistently, you would see results. To be very honest, if you want to see results with anything in your life, be it your studies or anything, to be very honest, anything, uh, you really gotta be consistent with that. It's never be like you just do it once and you're going to get result you know or just do it for 10 days no workout is something which is going to take months like literally month if you want to lose some weight you really got to change your diet you really got to it's like a lifestyle you know it's not like a one day thing it's like a lifestyle that you really have to follow to see results and I just love doing that because it's it's something which I personally enjoy. If you don't, it's not like you have to do it. But if you feel like you want to do it, just start by today. It's never too late. To be very honest, it's never late. For my blush, I'm gonna use another brush because contour वाले brush के साथ में ही अगर blend किया तो काफी brown दिखने लगेगी skin. And I just do not want that to happen. I'm just going to take my blush also up here. The issue is ke abhi thodi garmi start ho gayi hai and I have to set everything with my powder because ye sab to bhaiya transfer hone wala hai. I mean I just cannot let this be like this. Of course for my nose I'm going to use a smaller set of brush. and blend my contour with that highlighter ke liye i'm just going to use my finger only to be very honest wo kafi easily blend ho jayega you guys tell me what's been up in your life and what are your goals what are you guys doing these days and you know whatever just let me know about you and it'll be like really nice like a conversation that i'm having with you guys and you know just getting to know each other and the next step that she did uh, was using a foundation i'm actually using all the 
product that I really, really trust because this is the routine. I do not want it to use new products and that's why I'm just using all my trust worthy products. By the way, all the products that I'm using in today's video will be listed in the description box. So I have foundation and I will warm up a little bit on the back of my hand. I feel when you do that, uh, it's a good blend on your skin. So I'm just gonna apply it on the areas where I have no product. And I'm blending it from the finger. And I'm just gonna take my damp beauty blender and I'm blend the foundation. I'm just like trusting the process. I'm just gonna get a great look out of it. I'm just doing that to be very honest right now because now it's a lot of uneven look on my skin because of course we have a lot of contour blush we have only put foundation here so it's obviously going to look a little off but it's okay so I'm just taking very less product and I'm just kind of pressing it on top of my contour blush or highlight that I applied very very lightly i do not want a thick layer of foundation just the thinnest layer she said you do not want to apply your foundation close to your eyes that's exactly what i say and what everyone say because when you apply your foundation and then of course you're gonna apply your concealer as well so there's too much product uh, close to your eyes and under eyes are gonna you know crease it's it's the area which creases for most of us right so why do you want to apply too much product there just apply as less product as possible and concealer is supposed to uh, you know work for your under eyes so why do you want to apply foundation there do not do not apply your foundation there the next step that she did was applying her concealer like to be very honest i apply my concealer that would be like my second step and it's like i think second last step which is so different for me but yeah, we're just gonna do exactly what she did. So I'm just gonna apply my concealer because my dark circles are like really screaming at this point because there's no product here. Just gonna use my beauty blender for the blending. You can definitely use a brush as well, whatever works for you. And I'm just gonna press it right where i've applied it i'm not gonna move it so much back and forth just because i want coverage there right so uh if i just move it all around so sub coverage to guy so just blend it right there just tap 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 taki coverage wahi par rahe. can you see my dark circles are covered and there's no grayness at all so so when you use a peachy uh, you know undertoned concealer that really really helps so the color correcting wala step hai, wo cancel ho jata hai. So the last step for the base is setting everything in place especially the under eyes so I'm just gonna look up to make sure that there's no crease lines and then I am gonna take my powder and I'm just kind of dusting it off also first of all I'm just taking it and then dusting it off because I do not want too much of it and then I am gonna press it under my eyes so you just wanna you know kind of take powder all over your brush so that there's no patch it just instantly mattifies your eyes under eyes so again, I'm just gonna take the powder and I'm kind of just swirling it and rolling my brush in the powder, dusting off all the excess because I do not want too much of it and then pressing it under my eyes. Set the area where I get crease lines like my smile lines. Or wherever we have applied our foundation just there I'm just gonna take a little bit whatever I actually is left on my brush and kind of just running my brush there 
all right you guys this is the finished look that is how my base is looking in the end to be very honest i'm really really liking how my makeup has turned out it is not at all heavy or you know cakey my base is very very lightweight so yeah i would say that this is a really really nice technique to follow if you want to switch your makeup technique and want to follow something new and different this definitely worked out for me i really really hope you guys like this video and also enjoyed watching this if you want to uh, you know recreate this look and also want to you know follow all these steps i will leave the link of the original video in the description box below and yeah that is that what i have today for you guys i will see you guys in my next video till then stay safe stay at home i love you guys all so much bye